page templates can be applied to any web page, enabling style and branding to be managed easily. In this scenario, we have Alex logging into the portal, and you'll notice the branding is not quite ideal. We just have the logo in the top left corner, and it's kind of plain. So what we're going to do is we're going to modify the template that drives all the pages on this portal. We're going to go to Page Templates, and you'll see there are a number of pre-built templates out of the box, but we'll scroll down to the one we're working with, the Simple Base template, which is one that is already branded and styled to how we like. Over on the right, we're able to use all the widgets to add content and styling to our entire portal page. But we're going to delete that logo, and we're going to add a different logo, and we're going to pull that from our images library. So we we'll select the right one, insert it. It's a little bit too big, so we're going to choose a custom size and make it 300 pixels wide. And there we go. But we also want to add some content down in the bottom right corner. So we're going to drag a content block and click Edit, paste in the content we want, our phone number and email address, but we want to change the color. So we'll look at some more formatting options and apply the color white to the text and click Save and now click Publish. This template, which drives all the pages on our site, will instantly update all the pages on our portal. We hit Refresh and there we go. We've got the new logo and the phone number and email address in the bottom right corner. When Alex logs in, she's able to see the same branding and styling across her entire site. To experience a full demo of the Portal Connector, visit our website at crmportalconnector.com demo.